Thank you, Danielle Walsh, for talking to us today about AWS. What is AWS? Well, AWS is the Association of Women Surgeons, and thank you, Chris, for having me on here. I'm Danielle Walsh, and I'm the president this year. And uh, AWS is one of my favorite organizations. Um, it was really founded more than 30 years ago by Patricia Newman. And uh, it started as an informal thing. You know, there weren't a lot of women in surgery. And they'd go to these big surgery meetings and occasionally pass, pass by other women and realize, you know, we really ought to have an opportunity to sit down together. So they formed these networking breakfasts uh, that just a group of them would get together and eat. And from that sprouted this organization. Um, that's been phenomenal for, for for me and for many other women. And so uh, AWS I stands for? Association of Women Surgeons. And you, you so mentioned the founder, but I think I had a little feedback when you said that. Uh, the founder was Oh, who? I'm sorry. Uh, Patricia Newman. Okay. So Patricia Newman, who subsequently became a president of the American College of Surgeons a few years right. ago, sure. uh, was, was one of the, the main founders of it. There were a few other women that met with her at that time and... And uh, since then, we've grown to uh, an organization that's international and, and what, has over fourteen hundred members. Fourteen hundred. And, and what's what's the mission of the of AWS? Our mission to is to inspire, encourage, engage, and enable women surgeons to develop to their fullest potential, both personally and professionally. Fantastic. And what uh, tell us about some of the events and projects that uh, occur throughout the year? So uh, we have a really active group. Um, we have a medical student section, we have a resident section, and then we have a variety of committees. And all of them are working for, for women to try and do well. Uh, our big annual event is an annual conference that's held in conjunction with uh, the timing of the American College of Surgeons. It usually occurs the weekend uh, before the college uh, really kicks into gear. And fortunately, we've had a great working relationship with the college. They've been very supportive of, of us and our conference as well. But it's an opportunity for, for women to get together and discuss the things that we deal with as women surgeons and, and how we can work through them and how we can mentor and support each other in our unique struggles. Um, in addition to our annual conference, we have um, a variety of electronic media that we use. We have Skype chats. We have... Twitter chats, we have Twitter feeds, we have online blogs. So even the women that we have in 27 countries can communicate with us and, and, and get the support and encouragement that they need uh, in their professional lives through those media. We have a, a monthly newsletter that we send out, and this year was a lot of fun. I, I really wanted to put together almost a curriculum, a 12-month curriculum of everything the woman surgeon needs to know to be uh, successful and our our secretary Celeste Hollins and her team and the communications team have done a great job of going through things like how to do research grants, how mm -hmm. to have uh, deal with pregnancy and residency, uh, how to write a paper, how to be financially stable, all those mm -hmm. kinds of things that that we need. Yeah. Um, so those are some of the things we work on. Okay, and you um, said you have international membership. Who who can join? AWS. Actually, anyone can join. We'll even have men on. We'd love to have them <laughs> helping support us and, Great. And, and guiding and mentoring us as well. Um, but anyone from a uh, medical student through and, and even some of the um, uh, non-MDs, if a physician's assistant is working primarily in surgery, we have associate memberships. Uh, we have all kinds of opportunities for people to join in and, and hear our message and see how we can help you. And how does one join? Uh, the best is online. So okay. if you go to our website, womensurgeons.org, um, you can download all of the applications. You can apply and, and pay your dues online. And if that doesn't work, you can call our office. Uh, we have fax numbers and, and, again, Association of Women Surgeons or womensurgeons.org. Okay. So what other uh, points of pride or what else do you want the world to know about AWS? It seems like well, I interrupted you a little bit earlier. Are you, are you... <laughs> it's Okay. Yeah, we're here to serve. We want medical students uh, that are considering careers in surgery to be able to talk to women who are practicing and find out, can I be a mom and a surgeon at the same time? How, how is that difficult and how does that work out well? Mentorship. Um, right, mentorship. Uh, when, when women find they're in a difficult situation, they feel that they've been treated unfairly or 
um, are in need of advice on how to handle uh, problems that, again, sometimes are unique to women, um, that they can call us and, and we'll try and find someone who can talk you through the situation and, and advise you. Uh, we'll sometimes help foreign medical students or residents find someone in the United States to communicate with and, and hear about residency programs here and how things work. Uh, one of our big products is called the Pocket Mentor. And it's a compilation of thoughts and essays that started years ago. It's gone through four or five uh, iterations now and editions. And it's, uh, it's full of great advice. What books to read? What should we do in the operating room? How do we handle this and that? How do you, how do you get through residency? And, and the companion to that, the next iteration of that is coming out. So uh, Susan Pores and Nancy Gann have put together the professional handbook. Uh, that's going to be how to get a job, how to interview, what am I looking Terrific. for in contract, how do I uh, negotiate uh, malpractice or, or a work um, uh, endeavors. And so that's our next product that's uh, hoping, hopefully coming out in October of, of 2014. Okay, great. Last words? Last words? Uh, we'd love to hear from you. We'd love to uh, hear your thoughts. We'd love to have uh, more women and, and men involved. We want everyone to to uh, be able to find a supportive and encouraging relationship with the AWS. Great. Your, your, enthu your enthusiasm is clear. It's always great to see you. Thanks hey, a lot. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye. Thanks. Bye-bye. Thanks for checking out the Op Report. Help us keep conversations alive on topics in general surgery. Check out more episodes of the Op Report and other on-search content here at YouTube. Find us at Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. And find our homepage at onsurge.com. Join the conversation and tell us what topics you'd like to hear about and what people you'd like to hear from.